Hey guys, Caleb's Cards here. It's still early in the morning, so I'm trying to be a little quiet. People are still sleeping. But uh, wasn't able to film a video yesterday. It was busy. Um, didn't get home till a little bit after 10 o'clock. So I uh, got the mail, opened it up last night, and uh, filmed this morning real quick for you. I have uh, three baseball TTMs and two hockey. I'm going to start it off with uh, my first custom card that I've gotten back um, that I bought from Mike that I sent out. This is from former uh, Cleveland or no, Cubs, I'm sorry. I'm a Chicago Cubs baseball player, Bob Zick. Um, he signed a pen, so it kind of didn't come out that great on this card. I was hoping he'd sign in a Sharpie because uh, I saw him sign him before. But uh, these cards definitely do look nice. Um, it's still, it's pretty, came out, didn't come out bad with the pen, so I'll definitely take it. Um, I believe he is about 87, 88. And I did ask him if he served in World War II. He did not answer, so I'm going to assume no. He also included a photo, um, best wishes Bob Zick, he trimmed it down a little so that's why it's kind of odd shaped, but that's pretty cool. So uh, very nice man to send that extra photo, it's like Mr. Zick, old time baseball player from the 50's. And then uh, this one will be the reason for the title. Got two cards signed by Bill Spaceman Lee um, for his. He's called Spaceman because of his uh, like far out there thinking and and stuff like that. So I always thought he was out in space. So, but he was a pretty good pitcher. He had a really, really slow like curveball or changeup or something. It would just stay up there forever, it's almost like slow pitch softball and really fool a lot of people. So uh, he's pretty cool to watch on the Ken Burns baseball documentary video. So, so I signed the 78 tops for my set. The 76 tops which looks really nice. And then I also have a flashback to 2014. This 1971 tops. This would have been about June when I got this one back. So pretty cool. Um, probably the last time I sent him, anyways. Since uh, I decided to start the 78 top set, I figured I'd better send him a 78 card wise signing. So cool success from Mr. Bill Lee that was out there for a couple months. And this one, um, I saw this guy was signing, and I always want to send to him because uh, I've always liked having his cards in my collection when I was younger and stuff. Um, just holding on the cards and uh, he actually signed really quick even though the person who reported the sec success took like six or seven months so this is really awesome to get this guy back got him on three different teams on these cards it's a 88 Don Russ signed by Hubie Brooks and he is signing guy so uh, I did add his address to Star Tiger it'll be up on sports collectors got that when I report it as well and it's also on sports card forum so if you want his address, um, sports card form is free. You don't have to even make an account. You can just go to TTM Manager, type in the person's name, and find their address. Star Tiger and Sports Collectors, that you're going to have to pay some money for. So, Hubie Brooks, 88 Don Russ. They signed a 90 Fleer. That looks really good. And 91 Upper Deck, taking batting practice with the Dodgers. The 92 Ultra with the LA Angels. Or at that time, it would have been Anaheim. Or just California, I guess. I could just read the bottom of the card. <laughs> so that is really cool. To get him back. He was a pretty decent player. Played infield and outfield. So, really happy of those. The next are the two hockey, former Boston Bruins defenseman, 
Dallas Smith. Your old best wishes, Caleb. And uh, these are made by Sean Hewick. And the courtesy of Griffey Man 2430 in his care package for me. So I sent them all all these uh, customs out, Jason. So thank you for those. And I also have another custom, uh, Barry Peterson. Played for the Bruins from 1980 to 1992. He's also another quick hockey signer. So nice to add some hockey signatures to the collection. Um, I couldn't find any cards for him, so. I thought I did, but I guess I didn't. So that's all I have for you guys today. Hope you enjoyed. And hope you enjoy your weekend. Talk to you later. Bye.